All right, Patreon videos for this month. Now, these are the videos that YouTube won't allow us to play on here. So uh, first, we have Heartbreaker by Led Zeppelin. Starless by King Crimson. And Purple Haze by the one and only Jimi Hendrix. Yep, and it's all for just $1, and that's half your morning coffee. So we will see you guys there. Link in the video description. Hey, guys, hope you're having a great day. This was a great life. We're back with our first Dire Straits track. I have not heard any Dire Straits. Uh, I feel like I've heard the name. I think I've heard the name at some point in my life, but I haven't, like actually seen it like written down or whatever until youtube i've gotten several suggestions yeah. for this song like, i have no idea what to expect at all i don't even know what like genre i'm guessing some type of like rock yeah. that, that's our audience that's what they're probably yeah. going to suggest most of the time but i no idea what to expect but this yeah. this is apparently their banger their banger yep dude Whew. well if it's their banger you know what to do slap that subscribe button hit that like button hit that subscribe bell make sure you stay notified on all of our videos for this yep, because you wouldn't want to miss dire straits all right let's go ahead and dive into it man
The thing is that I do want to address first of all. Yeah. The the guitar saved the song for me. Dude. Just the the entire literally one hundred percent. Dude, agree. the the lead lines from the very beginning, the yeah. like the lead guitar like was the ish for me. Like yeah. the singer like he was good for like what he was doing, but he wasn't like. It was away. very singer singer song. Right? Like just kind of talking. Yeah. Like I don't I felt think kind of Bob yeah. Dylan. I don't bit. think he was like meant to like bullet. Like that wasn't like the point of his yeah. vocals. He's kind of like he's carrying the song along just because most songs have vocals. So he's. Yeah. Throwing on some vocals. Yeah. Um, the drums and the bass, they weren't doing anything too crazy. They, they were, but the thing was, they were playing for the song. And I can, yeah. like, I can respect that. You know what I mean? So yeah. they, it was, the guitar was the focal point, And I, I kind of dig that. It's, it's and a driving like it's, song. And here's the other thing. The guitar wasn't overdone. It was very tasteful. Yeah, he wasn't trying too hard at all. He, it's no. like he's naturally just like so smooth yeah. with his play style. And I, I, one thing that I, I don't know if you felt the same way. During the first solo, I thought it sounded very Pink Floyd. Esque, like yeah, the, it had the, that that type, like this. The, some of the, the phrasings he was using felt very Pink Floyd. And then the second time, mm -hmm. the second solo, totally different, totally yeah. different solo. And it was voiced very well. His playing was very good. There was a couple. It felt a little sloppy at times. I, I think th that, I was, that was the point. Almost, I, I agree. You know what I mean? And, and I think his tone was so clean mm. that like he had no distortion on it, no, nothing to really. He's not, he's not covering his tracks. Yeah, he's just giving it to you raw, raw. basically. So I thought it was really good. I, I do agree. I think that saved it for me. Yeah, I feel like without those guitar lines, it would have been like around like mid sevens for me. Yeah. But he brought it to like a nine. I'm gonna give like a nine point two. You know what I mean? I'm thinking eight point seven. And I say that the other thing that I think brings it down a little bit. This is a good driving in a car. You just, yeah. yeah. In the background 100%. sort of thing. Like if you're like this sounds like I don't I don't mean if this sounds bad. But it's like you're cleaning your room. You play this song, dude. You're just yeah. like you're doing something. Like it's in the background. Like you feel that those guitar lines. Yeah. His vocal is driving the song. Just the standard beats and all yeah. that. It's it's a nice song just to have. Like it's a song that you're not actively thinking about. Yeah. Um, and maybe that's bad to say, but I think a lot of it was the dynamics of it. And I think we said this in a previous video, or at least I did. But the dynamics of the song were pretty flat the entire time. It, it, it wasn't very many peaks and valleys. It stayed at like a six yeah. intensity the entire time, which is fine. But I think for five and a half minutes, it's a little bit too long to have no real dips or ebbs and flows. In terms of like the radio song they were trying to write, you think it might have been like a little bit like too long or derivative like towards the end parts? Um, maybe a little bit. Like, yeah, it just it, it felt like one part just repeated way too many times. Right. Not, in a, sure. not in a horrible way. Like I think it has its its purpose and its. This moments. is this definitely is like one of their radio cuts. Yeah. Like you can just tell by the songwriting itself. Not it's not a bad thing. Yeah. Like, bands write radio songs. That's why bands get big. You have to you have to write some radio bangers just yeah. to exist on that platform. It's just kind of yeah. how it always has been. I feel like. Um. And this is a fantastic radio song, but I do know like you can just tell that like especially the drum and the bass like they're holding back in this yeah, song. Yeah. For sure. So I wonder if there are any other cuts by them where kind of like they're just going crazy a little yeah. bit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Really let themselves. Because I swear. Yeah. I, I, that drummer, he held, he was good. You and know there's a couple I mean? times where he did some syncopated yeah, stuff towards yeah, the end. Yeah, I noticed that too. Where I was yeah. like, okay, was you definitely like, have okay, some chops. Okay. You have some chops. You just kind of... So, yeah, I want to see some cuts where, like, yeah. they're kind of going nuts. But with that said, this was a brilliant radio track. This will get airplay in the car. For That's sure. just how it is. All right. With that said, go cool. ahead and comment below other Dire Straits tracks. Yeah, let us know because we're going to check the comments for them. Uh, we're looking forward to doing some more of them. That being said, you guys have a great day. Make sure you hit that subscribe bell, hit that like, comment down below what you thought of the song, what your rating was. Uh, we'll be down there with you. Yep, peace out.